Breaking news at five, Pennsylvania now the sixth state to have a confirmed case of the COVID Omicron variant, the first case in the Philadelphia area. A man in his 30s has tested positive for the variant. Cases have now been identified in California, Colorado, Hawaii, Minnesota, Nebraska, and New York. Meantime, we're learning more today about how the variant is being tracked. Amy Wattis joins us live with what she's learned about that. Amy. Ken, doctors at local hospitals here in Pittsburgh are working with both the county and the state health departments to track the Omicron variant. They say it could take a few more weeks before we have data. Meantime, they are pushing for precautions like masking up and getting the shot. That's why I'm in, I got the booster shot because you know, we keep knowing there's new variants. Darla Justice is following doctor's orders by getting vaccinated and wearing her mask. Her husband, Bob, is doing the same. I just think people need to do everything they can to protect themselves and other people. Earlier today, before KDKA learned of the first reported COVID Omicron case in Pennsylvania, doctors said it was only a matter of time before we would see the variant pop up in the state. Well, I wouldn't be surprised if we already have a case or two in Pennsylvania, but at the same time right now, we're still overwhelmingly Delta. That's why health experts are doing what they can to track it. Dr. Graham Snyder with UPMC says the health system has a lab that can sequence and identify a specific type of virus. We also take a sampling of the viruses that we identify to confirm essentially what's being reported by the CDC and the Pennsylvania Department of Health. We are in the process of trying to start tracking it. So we're going to start looking at the tests that are coming in. Um, and we've done this before with the Delta variant where we take batches of tests and then we run it through to see which variant it is. Meantime, the Allegheny County Health Department is calling anyone returning from these eight South African countries currently listed under federal travel guidelines to ensure they are quarantining and getting a PCR test. Now, we also asked doctors about COVID symptoms and if they are different when it comes to the Omicron variant. We'll have answers on that coming up tonight at 6. Reporting live, Amy Wattis, KDKA News.